But with an embryo or like a very early stage um, you know, blastoid, you have the potential just to change the entire uh, embryo at once with one microinjection. So it becomes a lot more effective from a technology perspective, but also from a cost perspective. Um, the first gene therapy that was um, approved by the FDA for sickle cell anemia, um, Castro it's two to three million dollars USD per patient per dose. And, you know, for something that you can inject into an embryo, it would be like 1% of the cost, if not less than that. And one of the biggest issues for every country right now is the national healthcare spending for, um, you know, health healthcare for, you know, um, doctor consultations, drug pricing, especially in this country. And so if you're able to provide patients that have debilitating heritable diseases with a much more cost-effective and safer option, um, then why not do it?